Derry City's Cup heroics are in sharp contrast to their league form. And Bohemians were quick out of the blocks in Brandywell. Dan Kelly beat Kevin McCatty and set up Ginny Corcoran in the very first minute. What a start for the Gypsies. Quite simply, Bows were better all over the pitch. Hungrier, quicker and sharper. And when Keith Ward beat Rory Hale, his firmly hit shot was too hot for Jer Doherty to hold. Kelly in an offside position on the rebound. This cup quarter-final rehearsal was all Bohemians, a team with a real swagger right now. Dara Leahy's overlap, setting up Kelly again, candy stripes hanging on as Ward's shot flashed wide. Keith Long has seen his side win six of their last seven games, but City should have been level at halftime. Danny Seaborn's header well over the bar. Whatever Hugh Harkin said at half-time had the desired effect as Derry City improved after the break. Rory Hale went close, though Shane Supple was yet to be tested in the Bowes goal. Bowes defended deeper and City had their best spell of the game. Cup hero Adrian de Lapp's well-struck effort was close, but another shot wide of the mark and on 54 minutes, Bowes got the second. Kelly was again involved and as Seaborn backed off, his early shot caught Jared Doherty in no man's land and it squeezed in. His fourth goal in seven starts for Bowes since joining from Bray in July. Would there be a Derry reaction? Rory Hale set up Aaron Splain, but his long range effort went wide of the mark and at this level, you have to at least test the goalkeeper. Bowes got deeper, Derry had more of the ball. Shields and Splain pulling the strings. Delap and Shields with clever headers here. Ronan Hale shot, finally calling goalkeeper Supple into action, but there was no way past as Bowes kept their sixth clean sheet in their last seven games. Derry City are in limbo. Ten points off a European place, 15 points above the drop zone, but to be fair, they kept attacking. Kevin McCatty's shot deflected off Leahy and the post the closest they came to a goal. The best piece of skill came late in the game. Aaron McAneff, delightful spin away from Keith Buckley, his shot testing supple. That effort deserved better, but it wasn't to be Derry's day. And after soaking up all that pressure, Bowes nearly got a third. Man of the match, Dan Kelly, was again at the heart of things. His cross found Owen Stokes. Doherty just managing to keep it out. Mayhem ensued. And Devaney's follow-up somehow kept out by Rory Hale. And that was that. Derry's third home league defeat in a row for Bowes. A fourth away win on the spin without conceding a goal. It finished. Derry City nil. Bohemians two. You got a game plan, but when you concede within 30 seconds, that game plan goes out the window, basically. You know, and... It gives a, our team a foothold in the game. And when you give a team like Bowes a, a goal up in 30 seconds, you know, they sat and controlled the game. Thought we got under it in the latter stages of the first half and looked as if we might get an equaliser. But, you know, again, we shot ourselves in the foot by giving away an early goal. I thought we, we probably should have been a little bit more clinical um, at times. But, you know, we scored a really, really good first goal after a minute. Uh, scored a really good second goal, played through the tour. It's, um, and, uh, you know, it's been a while since we've won up here. So we're really pleased tonight.